Hey, this is Mark Dharma. I'm here in Santa Monica. High performance health, mindset coach, helping entrepreneurs perform at the best so you can look, feel, perform at your best, make more money, be even more successful, and be happy as well with what you do. That's what it's about, right? So I've got a question here from Jeremy Fontaine. And this question, all right, I'm gonna read out the question and I'll give you my thoughts. Hey Mark, what are your top three veggies you suggest I incorporate into my diet? And, so it's two questions, what is the best supplement slash cleanser slash antioxidant for someone looking to recuperate quickly from a long day spent working in flow? Thanks for your time. Thanks, Jeremy. Well, let's start with the first one. What are the top three veggies I suggest you recommend you put into your diet? I don't have a top three veggies to eat. I just think you should eat a lot of vegetables. You know, the, the, best, the top three veggies are the veggies that you are actually going to eat. So let's just go back to the basics of it. I think, uh, sorry, Jeremy, I think a better question would be how much vegetables should you aim to eat on a given day? Well, I recommend for veggies, you can think of like one fist size portion being one portion. To be at your best, I recommend between, I recommend like 10 portions of veggies, between minimum five, ideally around 10. So 10 fist size portions of vegetables. So when I'm talking about vegetables, I'm talking about I'm not talking about potatoes, carb stuff. I'm talking about, you know, um, cauliflower, broccoli, spinach, greens. There's, there's so many types of vegetables. And what's important is that you're eating organic, okay? Organic vegetables have been shown over and over again to have more nutrients, more vitamins and nutrients in it. And plus, there isn't got any nasty residue from chemicals that they spray on it. So organic vegetables I recommend. And I also recommend that uh, if you can grow your own, that's even better, growing your own vegetables. But eating enough vegetables is what's most important, okay? Five to 10 fist size, your fist size portions a day. It's not about what are the top three, it's about just eating them. Cauliflower, green, greens are usually a good one to go for, green colored vegetables. Now the next part of the question was, and what is the best supplement, cleanse antioxidant for someone looking to recuperate quickly from a long day spent in flow? To be honest, I don't really like this question. I think it's a hack question. You know, what are the top three vegetables? What are the, like, the supplement I should be taking to help me recover? And a lot of people go for the hacks. You're like, oh, you know, I know it's, it's popular right now, the whole biohacking, like what's the hack to get a bit more performance? And um, you know, I'm, I'm guilty of it too. You know, my, my friends are into biohacking. Shout out to Anthony Di Clemente, he's a friend of mine. I'll be going to his biohacking event. So I, I like biohacking thing, but I think, I think people, especially entrepreneurs, can get too focused on the hacks and forget about the fundamentals, the fundamentals. So you could, I, I could tell you what cleanser, what antioxidant to take to help you recover, but if you're not eating regularly, if you're not eating every three to four hours, if you're not eating your five to 10 portions of veggies a day, if you're not getting enough calories, if you're not getting enough sleep, if you're not doing exercise, if you're not moving throughout the day, keeping your body moving, then the supplement hack isn't really going to do much. It's not really going to do much for you. It's not going to help you live longer. It's not going to really increase your energy levels too much over a long-term sustained period. What you really got to do is focus on the fundamentals. Okay, it's a bit like being in business, and then all of a sudden your friend tells you like, "Oh, you know, I'm making money at Facebook ads." So you're like, "Oh, I better do Facebook ads," and you start throwing money at Facebook ads. You know, throwing money at supplements, but you know, your distribution model's not set up, or your back end's not set up, your customer service isn't set up, you're, you haven't got the fundamentals in, okay? Your accounting's not right, your, your product's not working properly. You know, you, you're, you're looking for a hack to bring in more revenue, but you haven't got the fundamentals right. You, got, you haven't got a sales team down, all this type of thing. So it's, it's, in the end is you might get a little bit of unsustainable performance out of it, and then you'll crash. 
So what I encourage is focusing on the fundamentals. What are the, what are the, if you don't know what the fundamentals, here are the fundamentals to energy and performance and recovery. First one is air, breathing right, okay? Deep breathing practices, breathing into your gut. Second one is water, making sure that you're hydrated during the day. That's, my, that's actually my best recommendation for recuperation, water. Drinking enough water throughout the day. Then we've got food, eating high quality, quality organic food and eating it regularly. And after the food, what have we got? We've got sleep, making sure you get eight hours, nine hours sleep, going to sleep before 10. And the final thing is movement, adding movement in. Because think about it, you know, do you really want to have a life of little short-term hacks that gets you, you know, maybe five yards and then you've got to retreat four yards back and forth? Or are you looking to build your life, your business, your legacy on solid principles that last, that can build upon each other and can really create something great? Because I'm guessing if you're, if you're, you know, if you're an entrepreneur, if you're in business, then you've, you've got a vision for your life and you've got a vision for your legacy. And if you don't, you better, you better go ahead and get one. Okay, well, what's, what's life about for you? Is it about little short-term hacks or is it about really creating the life you want? You know, creating sustainable systems for yourself and others to really grow into the highest version of themselves, okay? That's what I'm guessing it is for you. I'm guessing that you wanna create products, create businesses that really make a difference in this world. And you wanna, of course, look, feel and perform at your best and enjoy it while you're doing that. And I'll tell you, these types of businesses, these world changing businesses, you know, we can look at Tesla, for example, um, and these high, high performers, physical high performers, mental high performers, they're not built off hacks. They're not built off hacks. They're built off solid fundamentals. They're built off solid principles. And I encourage you to look for principles and fundamentals when you're looking at your own life and your own business. So I've got a question for you, Jeremy, and for you watching too, is out of the five fundamentals I mentioned, which one are you lacking? Which one have you not mastered just yet? Okay, drop me a comment, let me know.